Okay. Praise. Praise. Current topside temperature is 79 degrees with an estimated high. We're in! 90. We're in! The compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Oh, yo, Life Stealer! Thanks for the raid! Carbon Five Five million raid! No! Carbono, yo! How was your stream, Life? Good, good. Yo, yo! No, this is actually Hazard Course. Sector A, training facility. Please stand back from the automated door. Uh, but it's made by the dudes who made uh, Blue Ship. Tom. Tom. What? Hello? Customer. Oh, hey. Oh, I thought. Oh, my bad. Sorry about that. I, I'm getting uh, confused. I was thinking of something else. My moment. bad. My bad. Not true. Uh, you're Dr. Freeman, right? We were told to expect. I got it twisted. I played a lot of mods today. This is like the sixth mod we played today. Spreading misinformation. No, I just drink it, nothing in it. Sure. Oh, damn, life stealer. Damn. It happens. Hello. Look, he's here. Ah, Doctor. We wrap up the Bugatti. Luna, yo. This is too quiet. Too quiet. In the middle of the desert. At any rate, welcome to the Black Mesa Training Facility. Things have been in a state of commotion lately, but we're glad you're here. Just let me double check your file. Ah, I see you've already signed our legal disclaimer. I, Gordon Freeman, hereby agree to the following terms. Has any case of serious injury, dismemberment, toxic poisoning, burns, rashes, lesions, blah blah, etc., etc. Hereby agree to waive all rights as an employee of the Black Mesa Research Facility. Ah, yes, it looks very good. Now, if I recall, you're here for standard HEV training. Oh, oh wait a minute. Seems someone has made an error. Scientists, get the fuck you up down for here. the Enhanced Security Trainings Firearms 101, as well. Well. If this is on file, it means the required personnel are already setting up. No sense letting it go to waste. What are you? Follow me, and we'll get you prepped. Okay, okay. Scientists, get the fuck down here! I know I said do what you feel is right, but did we really need to buy so many things? Finally. Hello, so lads. He's here. Oh dear. Why aren't these sensors working? I hope they're not needed for today's training run. Ah, salutations, Gordon. I thought I should drop in to welcome you, as well as Why is he walking? everything goes smoothly. They assure me that all the training facility software is in working order. Best of luck. Uh. Welcome to the hazard <laughs> course, Dr. Freeman. <laughs> I trust you, So we'll just skip ahead to the information. We'll be monitoring your vital signs remotely via the HEV suit you'll be using. But do pay attention to your adrenaline flow, fatigue, any lightheadedness, extreme pressure, arrhythmia, or potential fractures. Well, you know, the usual. Most of the course is self-explanatory. Often literally. But we'll be around to give you any tips you might need. As well as grade you on your performance. So do try to give us a good show and enjoy yourself in there. The entrance is the elevator shaft on the left of the room. Come with me. Thanks, everyone. Just a bit of banter. Be safe. Goodbye. What could possibly go wrong? Salutations, Gordon. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, I'm just playing it chill. Hello, and welcome to the Black Mesa. I think we're a little loud now. I think that that one dude was just quiet. The hazard course, where you... I didn't click apply. Dumb brain. Will be trained in the use of the hazardous go, environment suit. I am your holographic assistant. MPO. If you see one of these Barry buttons, Chrysler. press it, and I will appear to demonstrate certain moves. Let's begin by stepping into your suit. You can see it's suspended in the next room. All right, let's get on with it. Oh shit. Moving around in your ATV seat can be slightly disorienting at first. So, I see you did your PhDs at MIT. Very impressive. Ah, yes. Just uh, Good job. Six scientists to show you how to climb over boxes and crouch through tunnels, yep. The first move we will practice in the hazard course is basic jumping. You will need to duck and stay low to clear the next I want a monka slide through here. will also minimize movement noise, making you harder to hear. Okay. Yo. Quiet is a church house. We will now combine skills. Oh, that was fun. Good work. Monka slide. Dude, right? Yeah, it's kind of sad that this has to be a mod. You know? Climbing ladders in your suit may be a bit tricky. Take some time to practice. I can't. They still think we need to teach people how to use ladders. The next three jumps are more Give. Dude, the long jump's pretty badass on this Black Mace, I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, yeah, into the slide. Oh, chef's kiss. Please enter and start the lift. Now that you're up here, there's only one way down. That was quite precise. Highly inaccurate. I suppose it's a matter of perspective. I hear the engineers are working on a landing system for the long jump module. Not that you're likely to ever use the final version, but it's apparently designed to prevent situations like this. You will find medical stations and first aid kits like this throughout the facility. Please use them to treat any injuries you have sustained. Once a medical device is depleted, it will shut down and not be reused. To spin that control wheel valve reference Please note that some valves or wheels may turn back to their original position if they are not frost battle oh shit dude that hazard course is kind of like it looks like kind of creepy and abandoned a little bit like they're just like yeah uh sometimes you'll need to rely on more than your suit to navigate a tight space I guess we didn't do that. Okay. Oh, shit. Dude, when you scroll hop, it does like an automatic boost. If you can't push the obstacle out of your way, you might try pulling or lifting it. Oh. If nothing else works, you might try alternate means of removing the 
obstacle, pick up the crowbar on the table and pry open the large crates in your path. I didn't think he was gonna die. <laughs> I feel bad. Accidental or not, welcome to the Black Mace. One moment. Control. Control. Can someone please explain to me why this guy looks like an orange tank? As planned. Uh, yeah. What an asshole. Okay. Um, one HEV scientist coming in. Hello, trainee. Uh, oh, uh, doctor. You're about to be dispensed a standard issue 9mm pistol and ammunition. So, yeah, you caught me a bit off guard. Uh, I can see that you aren't exactly supposed to be here today, but... Uh, you know, whatever. Hey, you're scheduled for it. They're paying for it. So, let's make the most of it. Alright, I'll teach you how to use some of my cool toys. There are three rules on my range. Always keep the gun pointed in a safe direction. Always keep your finger off the trigger until you are ready to shoot. And always keep the gun unloaded until ready to use. But, uh, yeah, go ahead and load it now, though, because we're about to... Hold your weapon in a two-handed grip. Both thumbs forward, feet shoulder width apart. Put seven rounds in the center ring of each target. Hey, not bad at all. Now, I like your stance with your feet. And that was a pretty slick relay. But your handling of the weapon could be a bit better. Don't jerk the trigger, all right? Give it a slow, steady squeeze. Okay, let's move on to an automatic weapon system. Head into the armory behind you. This is your standard 9mm submachine gun setup with an attached impact grenade launcher. Grab ammo and grenades, load up, and they'll open the next room for you. Oh, yes. I want to see some EU aim. I am ready. Yes, sir, yo. Mary Chrysler. I don't see any targets. Oh. It's not NA aim. I was missing on purpose. What are you? Yeah, this is a hazard course. They added it. It's like a mod for uh, Black Mesa since it's not in the actual game. I was told this was very good. <laughs> Clueless. This guy. Ah, oh, welcome back. Did you learn something about security duty? Sure. Your HEV suit monitors blood oxygen levels, notifying. Well, that was quite simple. Wait. Never mind.
Oh, we go, we go again. <laughs> Great job. You're almost done. Yeah, dude, Kissy, I've been playing some of the Black Mesa mods, and they're actually really good. Like, they're, I think they're better than the actual game, like, some of these mods. Like, Black Mesa Azure Sheep is probably better than actual Black Mesa. This is the charging unit for your hazardous Power, 60%. You said no shot? Oh, come on. Come on, bro. Power, 90%. Shoot the camera. never changes this is so dangerous they're just like yeah let's just simulate like a bunch of shit blowing up what could possibly go wrong Universal ride. That doesn't mean you should go for a dip, though. And don't try to turn off the power. The room isn't designed for that. Ow. For your own safety, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Biohazards are also displayed with a luminous icon. Don't worry, that suit is properly shielded in all the right places. This is sure. a low dose for demonstration purposes only. I can't. The marker chemicals are probably just as radioactive as what we've allowed through. And so, don't worry if your vision is blurred. <laughs> don't mind if your vision's blurred. As demonstrated, the HEV is safe from any and all forms of damage. Please use the elevator to your right. Shoot the guard? What guard? Oh, <laughs> you may need to enter an area of the facility. No, no, no. Personal no. clearance to enter. Sure, Explain you. the situation. Open the door. Ask the security guard to let you through and lead him to the retinal scanner. He will let you into the oh, no. uh, I can't do it, T Mob. I can't do it. That's the bad ending. Yeah. Hello, sir. Yeah, please take my weapon. Right. Thanks. I wasn't going to do anything with those anyway, sir. What do you think? I'm a barbarian. You are now fully certified for use of the HEV Mark IV Hazardous Environment. Huge. This lever control train will transport you to a 
huge. Oh. Lovely. Lovely place they have here. Ah. Look at that scenery. Hello, friends. Say cheese. Congratulations, Dr. Green. Yes, you actually made it. And in the... 84th percentile of time to complete it. That's amazing for a first. Yes, considering that he had to stop and do that security firing range as well. Very impressive show, Dr. Green. Well... At any rate, let's get the good doctor out of that training suit and onto the tour. I believe there's someone waiting for him. Right this way, Dr. Freeman. We have a car waiting. Who's in the car? Who was it? Who was it? All right, um, all right, so Five Nights at Freddy's has a corpse. I have no idea what this is going to be. Hello? Hello, hello! Uh, hello and welcome to your new job at the Black Mesa Research Facility. Now, as I'm sure you'll recall from the interview, we at the BMRF are committed to knowledge, science, and safety, which is, uh, where you, as a guard, come in. Now, the night shift at the Hazard Course is a little, uh, <laughs> dull, but hey, it's a good place to get used to your duties. Just sweep the area with your flashlight and check on the cameras from time to time. Yeah. There shouldn't be anyone around at this time of night, so the uh, only motion down there should be the water in the canals. Now, you shouldn't need this, but just so you know, there is a door control on your security panel. In the day, it's used to lock the room down in emergencies, but all you should need to know is that it uses up your power, so only close the door if you really feel you need to. Uh, for, for that matter, be thrifty with your flashlight and the floodlights, too. Batteries are low on the budget list, I'm afraid. Oh, also, for, for some reason, the cleaning staff keep leaving a mop bucket in that room. Your uh, predecessor, he went a little loopy from the solitude and kept uh, wearing it on his yes. head. Yes, Strange. Joe. <laughs> he was always going on about having to hide from the purple man. I, I guess some people just aren't cut out for night security. Start to get jumpy, you know? But uh, no, no worries. I, I have a good feeling about you. Anyway, good luck on your first night, and I'll have another message recorded for you tomorrow night if I missed anything. Welcome to the Black Mesa family, and take care. Bye. Excuse me? What the fuck? That, I, I'm putting this on my head? What the fuck? Can I get up? What are you? 
How do you report the anomaly? I've never played Five, Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm not even joking. G-Man! is this man can I, can I leave now what the fuck did I glitch it you're not supposed to be able to get up well here we are um so wh what What's the purpose? Like, what am I? What am I doing? Like, what? What am I? But how do I survive? Do I just close? Like, do I just lock the door? I, I... Like here? I don't get it. And then this, this that locks the door. That was interesting. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Yeah, I mean, I don't. It, it's silly. It's silly. How's <laughs> it going by way, Cubics? Well, that was fun. That was cool. That was a cool, bod.